play a lot of roles here. Um, I try to give guidance to the company as a whole in our direction, um, watch what's happening in the industry, uh, look out for emerging markets, figure out how to position ourselves with clients, constantly refine our message, overview our products. I try to get involved in everything. I'm mostly inspired by other passionate people. So people that I like to surround myself with have uh, drive in areas that I'm not the strongest. So um, I'm attracted to that. I would say ask questions, but uh, maybe don't come in with any assumptions, come in with an open mind and trust the process. I think the advancement and the speed of advancement in the industry is a big challenge, but it's also a big opportunity. So we look into things like machine learning or AI and try to figure out how to account for those with new designs, um, and new technologies and new applications. Blockchain is a big new technology that we have to design for. So I think they're exciting. They're, they're not necessarily challenges, they are um, opportunities. I've never had any question about which direction I'm, I'm following. I, I'm in love with the work. Um, very passionate about the design and the technology and the intersection of, of interfaces and, and the web. Um, so I've always felt that we're on the right path. Um, the one moment, I don't know if there's one moment, there's been so many moments. Uh, every success feels like a great success because it's so hard. Uh, and it's so challenging and so when we get a win, when we launch a site that's really uh, really fantastic or wins awards or has high visibility, those things are inspiring. They inspire me and they, they put energy back into the team. So each of those things are, uh, are what we do, why we do this every day. I mean, there's a lot to learn, so read. Don't stop reading, consume everything. Uh, try to become a generalist at first and then find the areas that you're passionate about and then deep, uh, deep dive into those. Maybe get a little more sleep. Sleep is really important. Health and exercise is important. And I think we, as, uh, as younger people, are really motivated, but it comes at a cost that you don't really find until later when you run out of energy easily. I would ask how many other uh, intelligent civilizations exist in the universe. Um, all right, so I think the thing that is the most surprising is um, watching my daughter create things on her own. Um, she has a lot of uh, creative tools around her. Uh, paper and pencils and crayons and Sculpey and uh, Legos and everything that she could be creative with. And she's become a really creative person. So seeing her take those things and make um, her, her own in inventions that I wouldn't even thought to uh, tell her about is really, is really interesting. A lot of times she shows me something and I just have no words. So I love those moments. I'm a huge podcast fan, so I'm always listening to intellectual conversation. I like uh, Sam Harris. I like uh, uh, conversations about biohacking, like uh, Kevin Rose's podcast is really great. Um, anything about emerging technology, there's some great podcasts about um, AI and machine learning. Those are always interesting. Video, I love uh, Netflix. Black Mirror is probably my favorite series, although I haven't had a chance to really watch it. I want to say I probably have a bad tendency to research everything very deeply immediately. So it's hard to get through a TV show. If I uh, see something that intrigues me, I'll just go deep dive into Wikipedia and learn everything about it and 
people that are with, with me watching TV might be annoyed by that. So I'm interested in interesting things. I would say I've spent a lot of time in the last year just studying and practicing meditation, so I'm able to be more patient and I think emotionally more well-centered. So that's, I don't know if that's a thing I can do, but it has allowed me to um, really be more mindful of the decisions that I'm making. gadget probably probably my iPad but I shattered it so I haven't really had an iPad in a while so I'm probably gonna get a new new iPad the new iPad Pro looks pretty sweet this is super cliche but I think it's the um, I think it's the people that we have um, I've worked with a lot of teams in the past and um, and we've had a a lot of variations of teams here, but the current crop of people that we have uh, is incredibly inspiring and, and really compared to my career, it's the best team that I've ever worked with.